In Atlantic City and all along the Jersey Shore, Mother Nature came through this summer with an abundance of beautiful beach weather. You get to be out here with the wind and the waves and relaxing, get a little bit of relief from the heat. I've been here at least four times this summer. But despite tons of sunshine and lots of people around, some shore business owners say the summer of 2022 has not been stellar for them. It hurts. It hurts. The president of AC Steel Pier says its numbers are down slightly compared to 2019. However, the decline is significant from last year. I think people were hurt by gas prices and inflation, but they came down and enjoyed the free beach. The beach was crowded this year. Tourism experts say the Jersey Shore has seen big crowds this summer, but many people have been cutting back on the amount of money they're spending. They're not going to go out to dinner as often. Many of them had kitchenettes or whole kitchens in their rental properties, so they were able to uh, prepare meals inside. It's like a dagger. I'm not going to lie to you. Richard Riccio says the struggle for his restaurant in Point Pleasant Beach has been finding enough help. It's only been open on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday all summer. We've gone through everything to try to get people. Uh, they're just not there. And if they, if they are there, they come in. They work a couple of days and we never see them again. The mayor says other businesses are dealing with similar challenges. We feel for them that they're dealing with this. And certainly there are fears that, you know, we could show up next year and uh, some of our most beloved businesses could not be here. Many now looking towards this summer's last hurrah, hoping lots of people fly into Labor Day weekend with their wallets open. Ted Greenberg, NBC 10 News.